what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Neo has set it off. I'm talking F. Gary Gray style. What did Neo do? More like what he said. Neo said that parents should not be letting their children transition genders, suggesting that the minors don't know any better, but the parents should. I ain't got no problem with that. Now, Neo spoke his mind in a recent Vlad TV interview talking with Gloria Velez. They touched on a number of topics, but eventually landed on transgenderism, especially as it relates to children. He says he feels like a lot of people have lost sense of the definition of parenting, because in his mind, it boils down to being wiser than your child and knowing when to put your foot down and say no. In this case, he believes affirming a child's gender identity is wrong. Neo's rationale comes down to this. Transitioning genders is a life-altering decision, and he argues children, especially young ones, truly don't know what the hell they want, or on this particular topic, what they even mean when they say they want to be a boy or a girl. He hit his point home by saying this, I just personally come from an era where a man was a man and a woman was a woman, and that was two genders, and that's just how I rock. Neo went on to say you can identify as a goldfish if you feel like, that ain't his business. It becomes his business when you try to make him play the game. I ain't got no problem with that either. Neo, man, let me tell you something, fam. Everybody ain't got to do it, but it is refreshing to hear someone of notoriety, a public figure, especially a celebrity, speak his mind. Because, man, it's way too many cowards out there. I'm talking about cowards. Now, I'm not saying that everybody who don't speak their mind publicly is a coward because there's many ways to fight these wars. Some people can fall back and ain't got to really say nothing. Just find somebody who will do the work and get behind them and, you know, take care of them, make sure they got what they need, make sure they got the resources that they need to carry out the mission. So I'm cool with that, but some people don't do nothing. And they're just straight up cowards. They don't do, they don't help in no kind of way. They don't even bring attention to issues. All they do is sit back and get old and die. And let me say this, just because your name is in the hall of fame or someone found it befitting to put your name on a star and place it on a sidewalk does not mean you're necessary. Some people get besides themselves when they get these pats on the back and they start thinking that they're necessary. Nah, fam. Most of them ain't about nothing. See, I don't really care about your accolades. Your character is most important to me. What kind of person you are. Damn how much money you got. Damn what you do. What kind of person are you? Moving on, California got this bill, this transgender bill, man, and it's cold-blooded what they're trying to do. The bill known as AB 957 is working its way through the California legislature right now. It will require that a judge in custody disputes consider whether a parent is affirming their kid's identity in determining who they stay with. There are two other bills touching on this issue as well, AB 223 and AB 665. Assuming they pass the assembly, they'll almost certainly be signed into law. 
It is absolutely madness going on in California right now. The cost of living is out the roof. People are walking into stores and just taking what they want off the shelves. Crime is just out of control. Gunslingers are everywhere. They're passing all types of weird old legislation. It's bad, man. Neo was right. This transition and stuff is out of control. Although he's right, it's gonna cost him some career equity because that's just how things go in America. The good gets punished while the bad gets rewarded. Ain't that something, isn't it? Something how that works. Anyway, fam, America, oh man, America in trouble. It's something different, man, when you try to add another gender after millions of years in existence. You just come up with a new gender. <laughs> well, we're in trouble, fam. We are in trouble. All you parents out there that's playing the game, you should be ashamed of yourselves. And it is the parents that are pushing this on these kids. These little kids, four years old sometimes, five years old, talking about they want to be a boy. I ain't never heard a boy say he wanted to be a girl when I was growing up. Never heard a girl say she wanted to be a boy, a five-year-old, six-year-old kid. Never heard something like that. It's the parents, fam, as always. It starts at home. All you degenerates out there, groom your dog not your children. No more talk. What, what, what the haters talking about?